Hi everybody, uh, Orlando here. Just wanted to do a quick tutorial on uh, mixing with a uh, virtual DJ. Um, you're gonna wanna make a, a playlist before you even go to a party and DJ. Uh, you're gonna wanna listen to your music and make a, a list of the best songs that you can mix uh, so that way you have a, a, a better uh, product when you go and DJ. Uh, for example, we're going to do uh, make some trance music here. Uh, I made a folder already that only contains like danceable music, dance and like techno and trance. So um, now uh, another another uh, tip that you should know about is uh, you should analyze your your music. Uh, by analyzing, I mean uh, going to a, to a file, right click, and say. Uh, reanalyze bits per minute and that will analyze your file or if you just load the file I'm gonna stop this if you just load the file um, and uh, play it yo, 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 yo. it should uh, it should see it as you can see it it gave you the bits per minute that that file or that song has so but you have to do this way ahead of time. You select all of your music, for example, in the database. I selected a database. For those that don't know how to make a, a database, uh, meaning all the music that's on your computer, uh, watch my previous tutorial on uh, uh, filter, filtered uh, uh, files or folders. Uh, and uh, that, that'll display all the music that you have in your uh, in your computer. Um, so now, uh, after you after you have all your music showing, you would want to come here and select it all. Like press Control A or select the first song and Shift and then select the last song, for example, like that. So you will select the very last one and then the very first one, and then right click and then you will say Scan for bits per minute and that will analyze all of your music it takes a, it takes a long time so you're gonna wanna leave this uh, running maybe overnight it depends on, on how much music you have but uh, it can take a long time it, it takes about 15 seconds maybe 10 seconds for each for each song uh, depending on the length uh, once you've done that you can just come here and uh, click bits per minute on the top and it'll organize your files you know by uh, by bits per minute instead of artists if you select artists or a file by alphabetizing it now what uh, we want to do it this way this time uh, bits per minute so if you can as you can see you can see uh, that all the the the, the, the files or, or the songs are organized uh, close to each other too that means that this one has pretty much the same bits bits per minute as this one so uh, here we go we're gonna try to try and see if we can mix something um, let's see what this is um, I have my uh, uh, my earphones connected so I'll, I'm not gonna you're not gonna be able to listen to this right now okay so now you can so we're gonna start playing this um, and then we're gonna load the next song example this one which is 33 which means it's a slower uh, bits per minute but but uh it's pretty close so we're gonna i'm gonna listen to the song okay that sounds about right i'm listening to it i'm gonna pass it right here i'm gonna make a loop four put it start playing it and synchronize it that synchronizes the bit and i'm gonna start bringing it in I can just do an effect on this one, like a backspin on this one, stop it, and let the loop out. Oh, so, it's, so it's that simple. Uh, I'm going to do one more. Uh, let's do this one. Um, forever original. Let's see. I'm going to listen to the song. Let's put this all the way here find a good spot uh, starts pretty good 
so I'm gonna adjust it to start right there I'm gonna put a loop a 4 bit loop a 4, yeah, four bits and then I'm gonna start playing it it starts to play you can't hear it yet I'm gonna synchronize it as you can see uh, the tempo here stays about the same it doesn't change that much because uh, the, the bits per minute are very close so I'm gonna start bringing in the song you can kill the bass on this side start bringing the song so, so now we got that one and then we can let go of the loop and we can cut this one we can wait for a good spot to cut it or we can just do it right now and let the other song continue to play uh, Let's see. Let's see if we can do another bit. We can do a flanger. If you do a flanger, activate it, and then you start bringing it down. Okay. Go all the way to the side, and then uh, that's pretty good. That's if we. If you were to choose a song that's got a completely different tempo, for example, of a complete, completely different speed, like this one is 136 bits per minute, and then you come and select one that says 80, I'm gonna load this one, and I'm going to start playing it, and I'm gonna hit synchronize. Check this out. What happens to these? No, not to that one, but to this one. It's gonna try to adjust the speed to this one and it's gonna vary a lot well, it actually didn't uh, it's, it's not that much different and let's try a, let's try another one that's uh, let me try another song completely that's completely off let's see with this one synchronize you see what happens it changes a lot if you use songs that are that have a uh, completely different tempo so that's that's why you, that, that's why it's a good idea to use the bits per minute if you have the same type of music going on so if you're gonna change to a completely different genre then you wanna wanna you're gonna wanna uh, create effects uh, on this computer I don't have a, a whole lot of specs uh, you can do scratching if you have your mixer connected your uh, uh, mixer controller uh, you can do uh, backspins or stuff like that to cut the song and uh, it, when you want to when you want to change your uh, your genre so that means you want to completely change the type of music in most cases you gonna want to try to stay within the same same speed varying a little bit from slower to a little bit faster and back to slow so that you, you can entertain uh, your uh, your your people um, I hope this helped and uh, we'll, do, we'll be making more tutorials if you have any comments uh, suggestions uh, put them down below thank you